Most people in life are looking at how do I make a life worth living in the time of having. When a man is working on his radio broadcast, his audio cast that play on YouTube, he is often interrupted by people who want to have attention. The hardest part that people have to learn is patience is a virtue. Patience is something that a mature adult demonstrates, and patience is something that I have run out of. Patience in the fact that people want to play with my life, want to insult me and harangue my upcoming wife. What I mean by that is that she knows she doesn't belong to the person she's with. She completely knows it within her soul. But the people around her will not allow her to leave, and that puts her at total risk for abuse. When a family member decided that they would infiltrate my telephone or my computer or some sort of documents I own, it became evident by who was connecting to who on Facebook. At this time, the people who lie, harm, and steal from my life have been privatized in no way. They have lied to police officers. They have lied to people in elder care facilities. They have lied in their communities. They have lied at their churches. And they have continued to lie about me. I can be allowed in this world to be angry. And how I choose to define my rage is up to me. What I am angry about is completely not fully alone up to me. And what I mean is that you have entitled yourself to violate federal law against me. And as a result, you have incited a rage in me that goes into the political consulting room. But some shitbag little gay boy or fat-ass boy who's never grown up who works at a staple store interfered with my Twitter accounts. Because otherwise, how did they get on them? And why am I being sanctioned on them? And why am I being interfered with them? And why the fuck is someone interfering with my GoDaddy accounts now? See, even if I say this, someone will try to be me, claim to be me, insult me, try to take things from my pockets, and I get really tired of finding things that I put in a left pocket, found in a right pocket. That is a complete form of harassment. It is absolutely a form of molestation. We can see these definitions in that particular way online and offline in careful books on the law. But let me be very clear. The people in the force that lie, harangue, harass, steal, and literally rape, molest, and mutilate men like me and women who are not like me deserve to go to hell. The patience I have for the Lord today is that the Lord's angels has promised me, not from my prayers, not from my cursing, not from any epithets, but have promised me that those men and women who stood against me and against the Lord's plan in my life will pay dearly with their own souls and definitely with their own beliefs and truly with their own bodies when the Lord calls them home. You see, Jesus Christ is also a reaper, and he will send his reapers from hell to take them back to where they should dwell.